What is going on YouTube? Mark here with the fourth story time video for the series. So let's recap. Number one was about how I lost my possum in New Orleans. Number two was about the McRib. Number three was about how me and Ryan got stranded in, in on Disney property. And today is going to be about my friend Eddie's birthday party where we went out to Montauk. And uh, I had to pull someone off a cliff. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's go to this story. So, my friend Eddie... For his birthday, wanted to go out to Montauk. A bunch of bunch of us, a uh, bunch of us bros, wanted to you know drive out to Montauk. So, to this day, this is probably one of my favorite stories of all time. So, uh, we load up into two trucks. So, truck one was my was Jack, my friend Louie, my friend Dylan, and me. Now, side note, Dylan was plastered. Dylan was drinking the night before at a party, and well, he woke up and I think him and getting ahead of myself so let's go to car two because this leads into that was Eddie, Bobby, Big T, and I think just McGeever. Yeah, I think that's everyone. I think it was just eight of us. I hope I'm not forgetting anybody. That'd be really awkward. It's been a, it's been a few years. I'm sorry. So, uh, so Mikey and Dylan were plastered. They were drinking the night before. They woke up. They had a shot of JMO. And, well, they were just, they were just really, really drunk. So, we drive out there, and they were, so, Dylan was in our truck, and Mikey was in Eddie's truck. So, we drive, and while we're driving, they're passing the Jaeger back and forth. Like, between the trucks on the highway. Uh, I don't drink, so I don't condone this. Just, you know, I gotta say that for YouTube, right? But, it was hilarious, and of course, I got a picture of it. So, uh, we drive out we're in the Hamptons and both trucks are pickup trucks so Dylan I was kinda keeping an eye on Dylan and I look at my phone to, to send like a text I look over and Dylan's gone Jack's truck has like a small like this big window to the bed of the truck that doesn't close and next thing I know Dylan is in the bed of the truck I'm like how the and Jack's like Mark you were supposed to watch him I'm like I looked away for us like 10 seconds and Dylan was pretending to sleep and the second I wasn't watching he just jumped through the window and he's in the bed of the truck beer in his hand and we're like Dylan get back in here put the beer down this is so bad and it, it was so funny Dylan's just like drinking like he's sitting in the truck you know in the bed of the truck and we get to a red light and we're trying to get Dylan back in and Mikey jumps out of Eddie's truck and jumps in the bed of Jack's truck and we're just like oh my god so they're both they're drinking and they're having a good time and we're all freaking out so we pull over and well they, they just couldn't walk straight. Here's some videos. So I'm just going to let them play real quick. All right, straight line, go. All right, go. Come on, straight line. What just happened? Oh, he fell out of the truck. <laughs> oh, baby. So yeah, they were plastered. And it just led for a fun trip. <laughs> so we finally get to Montauk. We go to Camp Hero by the Bluffs. And Mikey and Dylan run towards the radar tower. Which is really cool, but not somewhere you want to be when you're not like fully conscious of yourself. So they run in there. So we all run in after them. Uh... So we run into this photography group, this uh, two, this couple are taking pictures, and they tell us we look like a boy band. They were right. So they took, so Dylan passes out on the ground with a beer, and they take a picture of us. So here's that picture. Boy band, right? So, still one of my favorite pictures to this day. So we, uh, so now I'm like, wait, where's Mikey? And then Louie comes out, and we're like, Louie, where's Mikey? And Louie's like, guys, I need help. So we run around back, and Mikey has climbed the ladder. And he's up, like, really high, waving this cloth. And I'm just like, Mikey, where'd you get the cloth from? He's like, the photography people gave it to me. Call the fire department, I can't get down. And we're like, Mikey, what? So we're all, and so Dylan, who's also plastered, goes, I got you, so starts to climb the ladder. So me, Eddie, and Jack all grab him, and we're like, no, you're not climbing. And then T's just going, go, Dylan. Damn it, T. So we walk, so 
we finally get Mikey down, and we start walking towards the bluffs. So we get to the bluffs. Eddie, Jack, and Louie go down the hill to explore. I'm watching the two of them. Uh, Bobby's joining me watching them. So Dylan and Mikey just pass out, like on the edge of the cliff. Like, here's a picture. So Mikey's literally sitting, laying there, you know, head over the cliff, passed out drunk. So I'm like, oh my God. So I go up to Mikey, put my hand on his shoulder. I'm like, Mikey, don't open your eyes. Just listen to me. It's, you know, it's me, Mark. I need you to just let me guide you. I was like, we're, we're here in Camp Hero. You just gotta, just let, just don't open your eyes. Just let me guide you. He's like, okay. So I lift him and he's a big dude. So like we... Like, I get him, like, off the ledge, and, like, I roll him over, and then, like, I had to ca help carry him back. And he was just like, Mark, you're loyal. I appreciate you. And I was like, I appreciate you. So, that is the story. I mean, there's, there's you know, that's, that's the general story about how Eddie's birthday became a phenomenal, phenomenal, like, you know, not an ex this wasn't what we planned to happen, but it was fun. And it re really was fun to look back on. But it was great because Eddie was sober the whole time, and he was just loving every second and just watching these two idiots uh, <laughs> make a fool of themselves. You know, it was a good time. You know, I definitely love these memories. But, yeah, so this has been Mark. Like, comment, subscribe. If you watched it all the way to the end, comment the word loyal. You loyal. You loyal down below. Mikey will appreciate that. But, yeah, so I'll catch you guys next Monday in the next week's story time. Peace.